Yeah, so once again, here we are. Let the fire burn down a little bit. Um, I got rid of a lot of pressure. I'm down to like 30 pounds. Right around there, 30 pounds. I took off the load. There's no load on this thing. And I barely got the throttle cracked open. Um, this isn't the most balanced machine. It's got great torque at low RPMs, and that's all I'm out for. It'll drive that generator easily. This thing will easily produce a horsepower, uh, maybe more, I don't know. At 40 pounds of pressure, I will have to get a more accurate uh, amp gauge and a voltmeter to uh, calculate my power output of this little bad boy. I want to build another one, but I'm going to do a four cylinder, smaller cylinder, a little bit more efficient. But uh, this is an educational experimental thing for me. And uh, it seems to be working really good. Um, like I said, I've run this a lot. At least a hundred hours, easily. And um, not much is broke, and what has broke, this thing is so easy to work on, I designed it that way. I'm more of a mechanic than I am an engineer. I like to have stuff easy to work on. And this thing is so simple, it's pathetic. It's a beautiful thing. Let's crack this throttle open, you'll see what I mean. This table will shake everywhere. That's a little scary. I'll open it up when I get a load on it. it this thing's got great, great low-end torque. And I'm real happy with it. Um, I know that's the, not the most efficient boiler, but considering it was free, it takes about 45 minutes to an hour to build up, you know, 20, 30 pounds of pressure. But um, once you get it going, man, you don't have to put much in there to keep it going. Ah, so anyway, thanks a lot for watching. Yeah.